Passengers on a Carnival cruise ship are all in quarantine in Seattle right now after a COVID outbreak. Carnival won't say how many travelers are aboard the Spirit or how many were infected. This happened just days after Carnival reactivated its whole fleet, which had been shut down during the pandemic. Nikki Batiste has one passenger's reaction. Overwhelmed at sea, that's how some passengers aboard Carnival Spirit cruise ship describe staff upon learning of a COVID outbreak. I've been on seven cruises since August, and of course COVID is always a concern. Darren Sievertson was among those who tested positive. I literally stayed in this room for six days with no telephone service. They wouldn't answer the phone. Sievertson says his travel companion and roommate stayed with him in the room despite testing negative and that a list of passengers names and cabin numbers of those who had contracted the virus was posted near elevators. The outbreak occurred during the ship's voyage between Miami where it departed last month and Seattle where it arrived on Tuesday. Upon docking, all infected passengers were moved to local hotels for isolation. Carnival refused to say how many of its approximately 2,100 passengers tested positive, but insists travelers were vaccinated and tested before boarding. And in a statement to CBS News said in part, our health and safety protocols exceed CDC guidelines and additional measures were implemented during the voyage. But that brings little comfort to passengers like Seifertson. Unfortunately, this ship was so unprepared and so mismanaged that many of us suffered greatly. Nikki Batiste, CBS News, New York. Warm temperatures today. We'll tell you how long they'll stick around after the break.